We've talked about the bundle elements, right? We talked about that they're really important. We've talked about, we've kind of given that hint of there's some supporting practices that help you at the bedside be able to meet your bundle elements consistently. Those supporting practices, if you look at this picture and you have the iceberg, remember we talked about the iceberg, is the tip of the iceberg is the maintenance bundle. All that stuff underneath, which in truth is much bigger than the iceberg on top of the water, all of that below is the supporting practices. Those are the things that we do every day at every encounter with our patient that help us to maintain the maintenance bundle, that help us keep the dressing clean, dry, intact, and inclusive at every moment, that it's always that way. Let's talk about some of those, okay? The nurse's workflow requires that the nurse is always acutely aware of their patient and able to anticipate any issues. I think you'll, you'll, if you think about that, the better you know your patient, the better you understand what's going on with them, the better able you are to protect them. That goes across the board with anything you do as a nurse. And recognizing those changes that are gonna require you to do something before they become a problem allows you to balance all these different care practices easier, right? If you know, hey, you know what? My patient's dressing is starting to just not be right. Or, you know what? My patient's dressing is, is I can see it's starting to leak. I can see that I need to change it. Or the edge is starting to just begin to roll. I need to change that. But I can balance that with all the other things I have to do if I'm aware of what's going on before it becomes a problem. If I know the dressing's starting to roll before it's hanging off, when hanging off, I gotta change it right away, starting to roll means I need to get that in my list of things to do here really soon. So how do you balance your care requirements? Those are the pieces. It's being aware of the changes before they become a problem that helps you. That's that balance.